Hey, this is Digital Bike Computing. My name is Emilio, and today we're here on our Synology DS920 Plus NAS. And we're gonna go through the steps on essentially deleting the volumes, the data, and really the RAID groups and the storage pools and everything that you've got on your NAS. Um, perhaps when you want to get rid of it. So we're gonna go through that today. Before you do that, please subscribe to my channel, Digital Bike Computing, for a whole bunch of videos. Click on that bell as well to be kept up to date. All right, so here we are on our NAS. We are logged in to our NAS over a web browser. Uh, I've just connected to the IP address of my NAS. You can do it over your DNS, your host name. And all we're gonna do is now log in with our admin credentials. Once logged in, you're provided a bit of information there. And where we want to go is into the control panel right here. We now want to navigate to, first thing, what I recommend is generally deleting your data first, if you can. You can go into shared folder. You've got some folders in here. You can easily just go into each of these and delete them if you want to do it this way. Okay, that's one way of doing it. Selecting delete, it'll then ask you to Im input your um, information there. And then you're deleting the share folder from the very and then you're deleting the share folder from the very top level. Um, if you've got a lot in here, that may take a lot of time. So we can just go straight away and just kill everything essentially from one spot uh, and remove your entire volume altogether. You can do that by going into the little top left corner right here, which is where you have all your applications listed selecting storage manager and you're provided a bit more information now i'm doing this for a demo so at the moment i don't really have any data on here but i do have a volume i've got a volume one and i've got a storage pool right here we'll just expand this a little bit so you can see what's going on on your nas you potentially could have more than one storage pool you could have more than one volume you're going to need to delete one by one uh, and that will go and delete all of that uh, that data straight from your um, from your NAS directly. So what we're going to do is we're going to now delete the storage pool first. So keeping aware that this is 8.17 terabytes, uh, remove from here. Are you sure you want to do this? Essentially, all the shared folders within it are going to be deleted. We obviously deleted one already, so that's already gone. But let's just go ahead and say remove. All data will be removed. Are you sure? Yes, I'm very sure. You input your admin password. The process will now start. It's stopping some services, as you can see right up here, unmounting the volumes, and then that storage pool will get deleted. That is now gone. So by deleting the storage pool, we've also deleted the volume, and now the NAS is really empty with four disks that are unused. So here we are, four disks, they're initialized, they're ready to be used. And from here, I can really go and create new storage pools, new volumes, do whatever I want, get rid of the NAS, uh, you know, sell it, or I want to rebuild a new structure. I want to put more disks in, remove the old disks, whatever you need to do. Simple steps right there on how to um, delete your storage pools and your volumes out of your Synology NAS. Simple steps right there on how to delete your volumes and your storage pools from your Synology NAS on a DS920+. Plus. Like, subscribe, click on the bell, comment below as well. Let me know your thoughts. Thanks again. We'll see you next time.